16 divided by 2 gets you 8. 8 divided by 2 gets you 4. And then 4 divided by 2 gets you 2, which is the first power of 2. But there's no special reason we have to stop at just the first power of 2. If we do this process one more time, we're going to divide that 2 to the first, which was 2, by 2 itself, which is going to give us back a result of one. This is why in general it's good to let things to the zero power be one. What you can imagine we're actually saying when we say raise something to the zero power is take that base and divide it by itself. And anything divided by itself is one. Anything that is other than zero. This particular way of thinking about exponentiation only works provided that a is not zero. Zero is of course the one number that we're not allowed to divide by itself and say that's one. Most of the time we just say it's undefined, but some people say, oh, that's infinity. And other times it seems like it acts more like zero. 